There's an exciting new Ethereum layer 2 solution called Linea. Developed by Consensus, the company behind well-known Web3 tools like MetaMask, Infura, and Truffle. Linea's mainnet was launched last month after a successful testnet phase that began in March, which saw active participation from over 5.5 million unique wallets. Also, Consensus has established the Linea Ecosystem Investment Alliance, comprising over 30 BC firms to back developers looking to build on Linea's ecosystem. All right, let's dive right in. So what is Linea? Well, Linea is an Ethereum equivalent ZK EVM layer 2 rollup developed by Consensus. As we all know by now, Ethereum faces scaling challenges, which has brought about the mushrooming of layer 2s, which are currently dominated by either optimistic rollups like Arbitrum and Optimism, and increasingly ZK rollups like ZK Sync, Starknet, and now Linea. Just to refresh your memory, optimistic rollups assume transactions are valid unless proven false within a specific time frame before posting transactions on the mainnet. This could cause delays and withdrawals back to the mainnet take up to a week to finalize. However, they are also the most widely used today due to their relative ease of implementation. Zero knowledge rollups, on the other hand, use zero knowledge proofs, which is a method of using complex math and cryptography to validate each transaction. This theoretically makes them able to provide faster confirmations because all transactions are proven valid using zero knowledge proofs and with the highest security guarantees, removing the need to wait for a dispute window to pass. The challenge, however, lies in generating and proving the zero knowledge proofs as they are complex and require substantial computational power to create. As we can see from StarkNet's current performance, it is still rather slow despite its supposed scalability benefits. To overcome this, Linea utilizes lattice-based cryptography to create zero-knowledge proofs for each transaction on its network. Lattice-based encryption demands less computational power, computes faster, and is easier to implement compared to other encryption systems. This efficiency results in cheaper and faster transactions. To connect with Ethereum's mainnet, Linea employs its canonical message service using post bots to exchange data between the two networks. These post bots listen for calls on smart contracts and relay information to the other network. In in summary, Linea's layer 2 approach involves using zero-knowledge proofs powered by lattice-based cryptography to validate transactions on its network. It then bundles these validated transactions using roll-up technology and submits them to Ethereum through the canonical message service. Another challenge faced by zero-knowledge rollups is EVM compatibility. This is due to the complexity and inflexibility of ZK rollups, making it harder to implement smart contracts compared to optimistic rollups. However, Linea claims to have a developer-ready and EVM equivalent ZK EVM. Being EVM equivalent means more than just being compatible with Ethereum. It ensures that smart contract code executes in the same way as it does on Ethereum. To to illustrate this distinction, other ZK rollups like ZK Sync 2.0 offer only language level compatibility. Developers write Solidity code, Ethereum smart contract language, which then gets transpiled into a different language when executed. In fact, StarkNet, another ZK rollup, does not offer EVM compatibility, which forces developers to write smart contract code in a different language. In contrast, Linea is bytecode EVM compatible, enabling seamless deployment of applications from Ethereum to Linea without any code modifications. Polygon ZK EVM also claims to have the same capability. This bytecode EVM compatibility could make Linea an appealing choice for developers seeking easy integration with the Ethereum ecosystem. According to Linea's docs, it takes about 20 minutes to bridge ETH from Ethereum to Linea and at least eight hours to bridge from Linea back to Ethereum. This, however, is still much quicker than optimistic rollups where users have to wait at least a week to receive bridge tokens on mainnet. 
As of now, Linea does not have a token and Consensus has stated that they have no immediate plans for a token, thus ETH is used on the network for gas fees. However, Linea initiated a campaign called Linea Voyage in May, lasting for two months, and the goal was to incentivize participants to stress test its testnet, resulting in an impressive 47 million transactions during that period. Now that Linea has entered its mainnet phase, participants who completed on-chain challenges provided by Linea have received up to five NFTs as a commemoration of the successful testnet. Despite being a relatively new layer 2 solution, Linea already boasts an impressive ecosystem directory on its website, listing 64 projects spanning various sectors, including DeFi, gaming, NFTs, and more. Moreover, the network is set to welcome well-known projects like Aave, SushiSwap, and PancakeSwap in the near future. Users can seamlessly engage with the Linea ecosystem using the MetaMask wallet. Alternatively, Linea also supports a few other wallets like Fox Wallet, Crystal, Nabox, and Desig. As seen on DeFi Llama, Linea's nine DeFi dApps currently hold approximately 14 million in total value locked, with Linea Bank, a non-custodial lending protocol supporting ETH borrowing and lending, accounting for about half of this TVL. Moving forward, Consensus has plans to decentralize Linea's network through several phases. Currently, Linea is in phase zero, where it introduces its EVM equivalent ZK EVM and establishes a security council to oversee the network and protect users from potential risks from using a new protocol. In phase one, Linea will make its software stack open source and ensure that its ZK EVM can cover all EVM functions. Moving to phase two, Linea aims to expand its security council to decentralize decision making and avoid bias. Additionally, it will enable censorship resistant withdrawals to enhance user rollout operators from blocking transactions. Phase 3 addresses the centralization challenge posed by zero-knowledge rollups as Linea plans to decentralize its operators and governance. This step will lead to a more trustless and community-centric platform. Lastly, in Phase 4, Linea will implement a multi-prover rollup system, providing multiple methods to prove validity. Furthermore, it will balance governance power to prevent potential governance abuse. By progressing through these phases, Linea will achieve its vision of becoming a fully decentralized and robust layer 2 solution. Since Linea's mainnet launch last month, the network has seen over 500,000 wallet addresses participating in transactions. Although Linea's activity may be lower than other more established ZK rollups currently, it shows promising potential for growth as the ecosystem continues to develop and mature. So what are your thoughts on Linea? Do you believe it has the potential to become the next next popular layer 2 solution. Well, in case you need a recap on layer 0s, layer 1s, layer 2s, you can check out our previous videos on those here.